and her channel is kind of changing. Monday fun day, I think it's going to become an exclusive. I don't know, Karen, why are you watching? We have cucumbers and melons and little starts that we have to put in pot. Do you go downstairs, Floyd? You gonna bring your blankie downstairs? I'm really excited about today's video because I'm just gonna hang out with you guys today. Floydie and I are just gonna hang out with you and kind of catch up. It's been a while since we just vlogged, did a stay at home and vlog and hang out kind of video. So I feel like there might be some stuff to catch up on. Actually, yeah. Uh, our channel is kind of changing and I've mentioned it a little bit here and there. Where's the bananas? Yeah! Bananas! Do you want some pancakes for breakfast? talk about the fact that Floyd is about to be one years old. You big, big boy. We decided on a birthday party theme. Yeah? Elmo. <laughs> yeah, you love Elmo. Yeah, we're gonna do like Sesame Street Elmo themed birthday party and it's gonna be in Saskatoon because that's, we're gonna be driving through Canada at that time. So it kind of worked out perfectly. My parents are gonna meet us in Saskatoon. That's where Chad's parents live. And then the rest of your family's in Newfoundland. <coughs> You're going all the way to Newfoundland. <coughs> Someone does not want to eat their breakfast today. Not gonna happen, so I'm just gonna set them free. I have no problem eating leftover pancakes. You may have noticed that we didn't have a Monday fun day video this week. And that's because I think we're gonna change how we're doing things right now with the whole van. I'm still gonna put out two videos a week, so don't worry there. But Monday fun day, I think is going to become an exclusive um, for Patreon members. So I will we'll do one family hike day a month and we'll share it just on Patreon. But we will still have two videos a week here on YouTube. I think one is gonna be more van life related and then my Thursday videos, which I really enjoy doing like this one. So if you're all about the Monday fun days or if you're interested in doing Patreon, I really want to provide some fun stuff. 
So you will get one bonus video a month. I'm also going to do a weekly photo album for just our Patreon members. So it'll be photos that you haven't seen on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, you haven't seen these photos anywhere. So you'll get a weekly photo album update. I'm thinking maybe like when we're driving across Canada, I'll do um, postcards. I haven't had, I don't have it all completely set up yet, but I, I'm just trying to make sure that it, I'm giving you guys some really exciting things to look forward to. If you would be interested in doing Patreon, let me know in the comments below, just so I can kind of have an idea who might be interested, or how many people I guess would be interested. Let's fix this. Floyd has decided it's time to do laundry. It's his favorite chore. Floyd got a swimming pool from his nan and pa in the spring in April when we went to Alberta. So we're looking forward to setting that up. While Floyd naps, I'm just gonna work on my video and get some editing done until he wakes up. Baby's back from his nap. Baby's back from his nap. Oh, it's a big drooly drool. I'm gonna whip up some lunch. I'm gonna make lentil, kind of veggie nuggets. You're supposed to put carrots and zucchini in them as well as peas and corn, but I don't have that. So it's just peas and corn, lentils, and breadcrumbs pretty much. And then we have to rotate toys today because I haven't done it in a really long time and Floyd hasn't touched any of his toys in a really long time, so he must be <laughs> bored. First things first. I don't have parchment paper. I will use tin foil instead of parchment paper and I'll just put a little bit of oil so hopefully it doesn't stick. I recently had somebody comment on a video and say, why am I watching you make pancakes? I don't know, Karen, why are you watching? If you're not into watching me make Floyd food, let me know, because I can cut that. But if you don't mind, or if you like watching me make Floydy some lunch stuff, I enjoy making it with you. While Floyd was napping, I soaked the red lentils for 30 minutes, so I'm just going to give them a drain. What you doing? That says family. It says, that hippie family. Floyd gets scared of loud noises unexpectedly now, so... I'll hold his hand while the food processor goes.
Okay, nuggets cook for 30 minutes. This is the first time I ever used this recipe. I felt like I, if I added an egg, it would have been stickier and held together better. So we'll see how they turn out, and if I do this recipe again, maybe I would add an egg. Well, that's cooking. I'm just going to pull out some things from the freezer for Floyd for dinner since I have the corn and peas out. I'm just going to put some corn into a little dish. We can have some corn later. And then I think I have some sweet potato in the freezer. Let's see. I do have some sweet potatoes, so I'm going to pop one of these out and put it in a container to thaw for dinner as well. And I think I'm making chili, vegetarian chili for dinner tonight. So I will put some beans aside for him when I make dinner. These are actually really good. I'm dipping mine in mayo. They're a little bit crispy though for Floyd. From the oil. I do not know why I fed him beets when he was wearing white. We need to do an outfit change. There you go. Floyd can. In this little basket, I keep all of the little toys, but we definitely have way too many little toys out right now. You gonna keep that one? Okay, so we'll keep this basket of toys. Yeah. We're gonna then to take, he likes Mr. Pickle a lot lately. Mr. Pickle can stay, we'll get rid of this stuffed animal. And maybe we'll keep this stuffed animal. We're gonna get rid of the little books. And we're gonna get rid of this thing. It's probably his favorite toy, he loves this thing. I'm just tired of cleaning it up right now. Oh, see ya. He loves this thing right now. So that can stay. Where's your car? Yes, that's your car. We'll go get him some new toys from upstairs. I keep all his toys in a toy box upstairs in the bedroom. and I found this travel bassinet. I'm gonna take it out to the shed and it's Floyd's new favorite toy. He's been in there now maybe 20 minutes. I put Floyd down for a nap and I figure now is a good time to work on this mess I kind of have going on in here. When we got the shed, um, we have a shed outside now, and we've started kind of taking stuff out of the house that we don't need in here all the time to make it a little less cluttered in here. So, some things include luggage, 
and my now winter wardrobe because I'm paranoid <laughs> of anything happening to my stuff while it's in a plastic tote. I have, oh, don't mind the sound, the washing machine is going. One of these bags, these giant like Ziploc bags where you suck the air out to make it small. Floyd had a little bit longer than usual nap actually. It's almost time for daddy to get home, so when Chad gets home, I want to show you guys the garden. Daddy's home! There's Daddy. Hi, Floyd. Hi, my boy. Hi, my sweet boy. Hey, you come in? Oh, what's that? Is that trees? Let's give you a quick tour of our garden. I'll go back and show you up at the house, but we have cucumbers and melons in little starts that we have to put in pots and then they're gonna grow in this area right here. There's cherries. So these are our cucumbers and our melons, which are doing really well. Those are the ones we're gonna put in pots. And then Chad's got some tomatoes in his little greenhouse that have started. And then we're gonna put those in pots too. Might even, we need mostly tomatoes. I plan on like canning as much. Well, I wanna make pasta sauce, salsa, and diced canned tomatoes. So we need a lot of tomatoes. So we're gonna have to probably get more pots to put our tomatoes everywhere. But our garden is doing pretty good. Everything is starting to pop off and it's really exciting. <laughs> Well, thanks for joining me today for a day in my life with my baby. Lots of exciting future plans. Thanks for being here, as always. I hope that you have a great rest of your day. We will have a great rest of our day, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.